For tying your own bands, you will need the following items. The appropriate size band tubing, 2mm and 1.5mm Dyneema cord, a pair of needle nose pliers, a lighter, and a set of band tying tools. If you don't have band tying tools, a couple of 4 inch pieces of wooden dowel will also work. Using a figure 8 knot, you will want to create two wishbone loops using the 1.5mm Dyneema cord. Create a loop approximately one and a half inches long. Make sure to pull the knots very tight. Trim the loose ends short and carefully melt the ends. Next, using the needle nose pliers, carefully insert the knotted end of the loop into the small hole in the band. Pull the pliers out, leaving the loop in the band. Using some dishwashing soap on the pliers will make this much easier to do. To keep the loop from slipping out of the band, you will need another piece of 1.5 millimeter Dyneema cord. Take this cord and tie it around the band using a constrictor knot. Make sure you tie this knot above the knot in the loop. You will need to tighten the constrictor knot by pulling on both ends of the cord. Using band tying tools will allow you to pull this knot extremely tight. Test your work to make sure the loop does not slip out of the band. Then carefully trim and melt the ends of the cord. Do this for the other end of the band as well. Take a short piece of 2mm Dyneema cord and tie one end of the cord to the first loop using a sheet bend knot. Pull the band through the hole in the muzzle and then do the same thing on the other side of the band. Adjust the length of the wishbone per personal preference and then carefully trim and melt the ends.